mastermind is never one mind. A mastermind is a collective of minds. So if you want to be a mastermind on the on the production or the beats or whatever you do, clothes, videos, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Like a mastermind is a collective of minds. So, you know what I'm saying? Collaborations is always good. When you have an understanding of what someone else likes and is coming from or their passions or desires, then you're like, like 700 Bliss, for instance. I'm like, uh, well, I know you like this kind of sound. Let's put that in there. And then I have this idea about this sound. Let's put that in there. What do you think? You know, just like trying to put each other into the music versus like pulling ideas from the sky or however other people do, you know? It's just like, what are you into? Let's honestly include our interests in this so we're all being heard. I like collaborating with producers these days a lot. Like, you know, a young, hungry kid that makes trap beats and just programs the drums next to me playing my melodies works because it's like, a, you know, it's like a cheat code almost. You got everything. All the elements are covered. When I'm doing collaborations, I like to reach out to people who I like organically you know, bonding with, like, and people who can do things that I am trying to figure out how to do. Like, that's why, like, my best friend right now is my guy Thundercat, and mm. his brain is so genius. And it's like, I'm literally, he don't know it, but I'm trying to figure out how to play bass by watching him and his, how he works. Mm. And so, like, I just love having that kind of genius around me. I think that as a craft, especially for recording acoustic instruments, having an experienced engineer is definitely something you should strive to have. And an experienced producer, just to have an outside opinion on your music and performance and not have to assess your own vocals, and because that's a really difficult thing to do. Um, but there are so many records being made without it that I couldn't sit here and tell you, yes, you all have to hire engineers and producers. I think it's more about collaborating. And if that happens to be with an experienced engineer, great. But just realize your own shortcomings and find somebody you can bring in. If I want to collaborate, it's because I want the people I'm collaborating with, I want to taste them. I want them to be present. I don't want people to fall into my ranks. I want to share equally and uh, I find artistically that's the best way for me to work always be authentically you don't ever you don't have to adapt to somebody else's be authentically yourself especially creatively you know if you're not feeling something don't go along with it and say it's cool because it's such and such like I don't give a damn who it is it could be um whoever like you know I mean if, if I was doing something with Madonna and I just wasn't feeling it I would have to tell Madonna I'm not feeling this I just I mean honestly you know I'm not I'm not gonna roll with it because of who it is you know it's just you know even I love Sade but you know, I'm not going to go with something or like something because it's Sade. You know, it's, you know, it, 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 you have to be authentically yourself. Always choose that first. <laughs>